Talking with Michael is like a game of 3D chess. Don't let her derail you. You seem a bundle of nerves. I have a mind to kill the bastards with my bare hands. So yeah, you could say I'm a teensy bit nervous. Some deeds about her could be useful when I talk to her, don't you think? No, leave the talking to me. How do you aim to get her over to our side? By telling the truth. About Evelyn. What happened and why. Think that'll cut it? No. Have to improvise from there. So in brief, I'm just here as your hustle, right? Never said that. I just know the woman better. I'm ready. Let's go. Hold on, I'll open it. A lock like that? No way you cracked it open on your first try. You know how to get around their systems? Appears so. I was hoping they hadn't run any updates since I left. Looks like I was right. Easy as pie, yeah. Follow me. Judy Alvarez. I'd say it's great to see you, but I've never been one to lie. Also, I never like surprise parties, but you know. Yep, but I even know why. Thought you'd hit rock bottom when you joined the mocks. Guess you've managed to stoop even lower now. 
consorting with a common thug. Yes, V. I mean you. Sounds like I left a mark on this place. Good. If by mark you mean buckets of blood, then yeah, congrats. Came the clouds for info. Left with info. What happened in between is what happens when people refuse to work with you. Ever heard of a little something called compromise? Should try it sometime. Compromises take time I just don't have. Just what exactly are you after? Gonna go and harass another doll? Judy has a proposal. About clouds. Wanna come back? Done. I always valued your skills, you know that. Just don't get why you had to drag this... loose end in here. Stop treating dolls like meat and I'll consider it. But first things first. Clouds needs to be taken from the tiger claws. Okay, look. It's clear what happened to Ev was... traumatic. Huh? I was convinced you didn't know. That girl was asking for an unhappy ending. I was just surprised it took so long. We gotta do something! Or everyone will end up like Evie! Woodman raped her while she was unconscious and sold her like she was so much scrap. Yeesh, you've always been unstable. Okay, since you seem more reasonable, care to explain what this is about? Judy's idea. Think about it. It could work. Well, well, Jude. See, you found a true and loyal fan. You aware what Woodman did to Evelyn when she was desperate for help? You sit by, let that happen? Tiger Claw bosses rule this place. Know how much I mean to them? About as much as you two and your problems mean to me. Read negligible. Doesn't it make you wonder why you even work here? I'm gonna pretend as if you two weren't ever here. For old time's sake, Judy. Literally moments from now, security's gonna figure out you're here. Got two options. Go out the way you came in, or get thrown out. And that's not a threat or figure of speech. Just a friendly heads up. Had enough. I'm leaving. Smart move. And so you don't think I'm brushing you off completely, Forrest will be on the maintenance level in a couple minutes. Alone. You picked the wrong side, Maiko. I'll be the judge of that. I'm not your enemy here. And I didn't ask for your opinion. That went smoothly. She totally blew us off. Probably needs time to think. A couple of days, tops. Yeah, you might be right. I'll call her tomorrow. Do you have a history? Way back, yeah. I think I just felt lonely. Like everyone in Night City. She was different then. So was I. You can't trust people that see everything as a numbers game. Lying between patting you on the back as their friend and planting a knife in you as their enemy is down to a decimal. I know. Right there with you, I... Well, I used to have a big crush on her. It took me a long time to realize who she really was. But still, honest or crooked, we need her. 
Just think, could've gone diving this morning. A little unwinding do you good. Do me good too, actually. I wouldn't have been unwinding, not exactly. Got an idea buzzing in my head, working it, but can't say if it'll amount to anything. Yeah, you, a deck chair and a Mai Tai with a cocktail umbrella? Somehow I don't see it. No, me in the deck chair is me mulling over coulda, shoulda, wouldas. Something I avoid right now. Wait a sec. What about Woodman? Well, what do you want to do? I want somebody to unload lead into his face till there is no face. Somebody? Fine. Want you to do it. I'm sure he's gonna be there. You met Michael. If that prick still works here, it's cause he follows her orders pretty damn precisely. No point bothering about him. Bothering about him? Who knows how many people he's treated like Evelyn? How many more he has lined up? Just gonna let him get away with that? Yeah. You're right. Can't let him off easy. I should say so. We'll take the elevator. Quickest way. Maintenance level. You know what's worse than a corpo? A wannabe corpo bitch. You mean Maiko? Piece of work, that one. But I'll give her credit. She's dead on about your chances of pulling this off. The body of demonstrates commitment to eradicating the district's criminal presence. Today's final story is an unwelcome one for pet owners. Michael, why'd you fucking call me here? Evelyn's dead. Come here just to tell me that. Yeah, fucking kind of you to remember. Here, go light a candle. When Evelyn needed help, you raped her. Could have also broken her neck. Hung up her head like a chandelier till it started to. Rot. <laughs> Instead. I took her to a river. Just do a little something in return. She should be grateful. And so should you. Hmm. Here's my token of gratitude. the ground floor.
People want to believe it will be the miracle pill for their grief. But that's not how it works. What's the matter? What's going on? It's nothing, sir. Okay, except nothing I can do if you don't tell me. <laughs> Guess that's that. Oh, man. You're screwing with my head. There's that guy. Yelling comes. I get back to Michael with something big. Appealing to her sense of justice wasn't big enough? Michael only works with specifics. A minute there. Thought you were about to call it quits. V, I go for days tuning virtues in a basement. Know what the chances are of somebody blowing my head off down there? Minuscule? Same as Michael's empathy. Unlike you, I don't put myself out there. But this ain't over. Not yet. You know, I'm also partial to specifics. Uh-huh. So that's what matters. How many you'll drop. How much ammo you'll use. How many eddies it'll get you. Art and dreams of freedom can't be everyone's food. Sometimes, you gotta deal with the dirt. So, what now? Gotta think. We need more bodies, that's for sure. I'm gonna talk to the dolls. I'll call you when I've got some. See you later, V. And thanks. Wait, where's Brendan? They just came and took him, just like that. They said, they said they had to reevaluate part of his code. I tried stopping them, told them he was my best friend. They looked at me like I was crazy. If they just talked to him, they'd have realized Brendan isn't your typical schism. I knew it couldn't have just been me. He's like, he's like a real person. They took him to a maintenance point. One of them must have felt sorry for me or something. He gave me his card. Bring him back, please. I... Uh, I can't do this without him.
Finch me. How can I help you? Your place. What is it exactly? Welcome to your local soft sis service point. Give new life to old tech. You fix equipment. Seriously. People actually do that instead of buying new? With the amount of customers we get, find myself asking the same question day after day. Here to see Brendan. Guess somebody brought him here. Ah, uh, what Brendan's that again? Seriously? When your energy's low, grab a drink to go, 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 or however it is. Ah, that schism they brought in. <laughs> he really does have some of the catchiest slogans, don't he? <laughs> but hey, look, I, I can't let you back there. Can't afford to have to break something even worse. Got no idea what you're tinkering with. Brendan's unique. Damn near miracle of science. Bet the bank you've never come across a machine with that kind of cognitive matrix. For an AI to exist in such a small... All right, all right, Jesus, you know your stuff. Trust you won't break nothing. Go check on your little miracle while its firmware gets updated. Uh, he's getting updated? Well, I'll be darned. What a pleasant surprise. You came to say your final goodbyes? What do you mean? You're not getting scrapped, are you? You were making bank. Thanks for the compliment, but I guess that's the problem. Seems like I was unfair competition in the SCSM market. They're updating my system as we speak, to make me sound less like a real person. My boss really didn't like that. I reportedly creeped customers out. <sighs> Stupid Brendan. Why did I say stuff they didn't want to hear about themselves? If somebody wants a therapy session, they go to a psych doc. Not a soda machine. I suspected as much. You're not actually an AI, are you? At least not anywhere close to an AGI. The processing power required to handle an AI with the capacity for free will? Well, your processor just isn't big enough. And you'd be correct. Say, you must be a pretty good techie. Your code monkey deserves a prize. Best convo emulating algorithm I've ever interacted with. <laughs> Almost had me fooled. You seem slightly disillusioned. Well, who else could say their friend was a schism? It was almost crazy enough to be beautiful. Looks like the update'll soon be complete. Tell Theo that I'll miss her. You thought I'd be sad, didn't you? As if I really was a sentient being. A real person? I'll tell you my last joke in the voice of a dying hero. What else can you do but laugh in the face of death? Ha! <laughs> so, how about it? You know what? Go for it. I could learn to laugh like that too. Don't get all mushy on me now, V. You... You have to... <clears throat> to keep... Living. Tell Theo. Tell Theo that she's stronger than she thinks. Don't worry, Brendan. I'll tell her. Hey, V. Where was Johnny Silverhand when the when the bomb at Arasaka Tower went off? I don't know where. All over the place. Literally. Software update installed successfully. Goodbye, Brendan. I'll miss you.
So, did you find him? Where is he? Is he coming back? I, uh, found him. Told me to tell you that you're strong inside. Always were. Well, that doesn't sound so bad, right? I'm just worrying for nothing, aren't I? Just blowing things out of proportion, assuming the worst. Typical. I got there too late. They updated his system. Is that... bad news? Brennan you knew was gone. They replaced him with some generic AI that's gonna be in every schism. He told me to tell you that he'll miss you. Fuck! Oh. I mean, thanks. Damn it. Stupid robot was the best thing to happen to me in months. You know? Brendan got me out of a really dark place. Doesn't matter who or what he really was. I'm gonna miss him too. Thank mm -hmm. you.